Good morning, Third Standard Butterflies. I'm very happy to meet you all again. In our last class, we discussed about natural things and human-made things. There is another difference between things. They are living things and non-living things. Do you say what is meant by living things? Yes, you are right. The things which have life, which are alive, are called living things. Example, plants and animals. The things which do not have life is called non-living things. Stars, moon, air, water, furniture, buildings, etc. are examples for non-living things. Let us see what are the differences between living things and non-living things. First one, the living things need food. Living things need food to grow. You all had your breakfast. We need food to grow. All living organisms need food to grow. Non-living things do not need food to grow. The second difference between living things and non-living things is all living things grow. When you plant a mango seed, the mango seed germinates to form a seedling. That seedling grows into a plant and after some years it becomes a huge tree. From that mango tree to huge tree, that plant grows. All living things grow. A baby grows into an adult. Egg hatches to form chicks, chicks to cock. But non-living things do not grow. Another difference between living things and non-living things is living things breathe. We need air to breathe, but non-living things do not breathe. All living things feel. You are laughing when you are happy. You are crying when you are sad or you feel pain because we have some emotions. We are showing emotions because of our feelings. Plants also grow towards light. That also shows some response. But non-living things do not show feelings. The most important difference is living things reproduce. The process of giving birth to young ones, the process of producing young ones is known as reproduction. Cat gives birth to kittens, dogs to puppies, humans to babies. All living things give birth to young ones. That process is called reproduction. What is meant by reproduction? The process of giving birth to young ones. But non-living things never reproduce. The another difference is all living things move. Birds fly, human beings walk, frogs hop, plants are moving towards light. All this shows movements. But no living things cannot move their own. Living things can move. So dear children, what are the differences between living things and non-living things? Or what are the characteristic features of living things? Living things need food to grow. Living things grow. They respond to stimuli or they show feelings. 
they breathe they reproduce characteristics of non living things are non living things do not move they do not take food they do not breathe they do not grow and they do not reproduce so let's wind up the class we will join in the upcoming days thank you for listening me